Hello guys, today we are going to talk about dual axis module known as KY023. This is the module itself, so let's get started. Today's video is brought to you by ORGVSN, an online store where you can find shirts, jeans and cool accessories that fit your needs. All the products are made in Italy, they can be shipped worldwide, so don't waste your time, start looking fancy today with their style. For more information go to orgvsmshop.net or check it out at the link on the video description. This module has integrated on board only one joystick and one button and nothing else. So let's continue with our video. Now I will show how these components are connected together. There we have the joystick itself and of course we can see the button of the module. On the right you can see how the pins of the module are connected on this board. We have in black the flow of the ground, we have in red the flow of the voltage, we have in blue the flow of the analog pin of X axis, we have in orange the analog pin of Y axis and of course we have in green the flow of the signal pin. The PS2 style joystick is a thumb operated device that when put to a creative use offers a convenient way of getting operator inputs. It fundamentally consists of two potentiometers and a push button switch. The two potentiometers indicate which direction the potentiometer is being pushed. In the non-operated mode, the potentiometer is in the middle so that the both resistors are equal and that the voltage will be equally split to both resistors. If one of the axis changes, like the x-axis for example, the value of the resistor will change. For example, value of resistor 1 will raise so will impact the fall to the resistor 2 or the value of the resistor 1 will fall and the value of the resistor 2 will raise. According to the division of the resistor values you can measure a specific voltage value between the resistors and locate the position of the axis. The switch sends a low signal when a joystick knob is pressed. Let's talk about the pins. The pins in this module are 5. We have the ground pin with G and D sign, the voltage pin with plus 5 sign, two analog pins with VRX and VRY sign, and of course the digital pin named SW. So let's talk about the signal. This module gives two analog signal and one digital signal. So we can connect the analog pin of the signal with any analog port and the digital pin of the signal with any digital port of different microcontroller boards like Arduino or Raspberry Pi. That's it guys for today. If you like the video hit that like button. If you want more videos like this one hit the subscribe button with a bell icon so you'll be notified for every video. We upload new videos every day so the only chance to see them first is of course through subscription. Don't forget to check our social media and see you guys next time.